Time wanders, in whose hands is life controlled. The Milky Way is vast, and where is the floating dust heading? Long and ancient, who sings in the corridor of history. With long hair all over my head, suddenly looking up at the time of my life. Flowers are picked up in the morning and evening, and things are flying and flowing with light. Who is the brilliant star in the long river of history? Becoming a king and defeating an enemy, desolate and heroic. The winner paints a historical scroll, while the loser sings with sadness and indignation. Throughout history, sages and sages have all been lonely, and thousands of years have passed far away. In whose hands is fate ultimately held? Playing the game of heaven and earth chess, laughing about a hundred lifetimes. All sentient beings are chess pieces. A lifetime of struggle is just a pawn on someone else's chessboard. Diverse and diverse, dominating everything. Infinite struggle is just a ray of afterglow between my fingers. Welcome to the world of the main god, welcome to my world. The main god space of Guyu. 2342504284 Full Order Book Group. 4519859244 Keywords of the Novel. No pop ups on the main road, download the complete collection of the main road TXT, and read the latest chapters on the main road. Chapter 1 Adventures of the Heavenly Descent. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Zhao Qi felt very distressed, really distressed. He was walking well on the road, but suddenly he felt something extra in his mind. No, it wasn't a feeling, it was like something was really squeezing in his brain. This feeling almost made Zhao Qi faint with pain. He sat down on the road, ignoring the silly expression on his face from the people around him. He felt his whole brain was dizzy, as if billions of people were constantly whispering something in their ears, but even when he listened carefully, he couldn't hear anything. Young man, young man, what are you doing? I don't know how long it has been, but an old man's voice suddenly rang in Zhao Qi's ear. He shook his swollen and painful head, squinted his eyes, and found himself sitting on the roadside, surrounded by people watching the excitement. Strange things happen every year, especially this year. This person even fell while walking on the road, it's really not easy. That's right, don't break your mind. Look at him sitting on the ground and never turning back. Don't speak recklessly, what if he falsely accuses you? Listening to the whispers of the group around him, Zhao Qi was not feeling well. He didn't care about the commotion around him, nor did he consider what had happened to himself. He quickly stood up and ran out of this circle of people. What's wrong with me? Sitting in his rental room, Zhao Qi couldn't help but think of what had happened to him. After thinking for a moment, Zhao Qi tried to focus his attention on his own brain. At first glance, Zhao Qi felt something exploding in his brain like an explosion. With an, ah, sound, Zhao Qi fainted again. I don't know how long it took, but Zhao Qi finally opened his eyes. In an instant, it seemed like billions of divine lights were constantly exploding, merging, and nurturing in his eyes. In the blink of an eye, it returned to ordinary, as if it had just been an illusion. Sitting on the bed, Zhao Qi let out a long sigh. He reached out his finger and nodded in the void, analyze, integrate, create. Come on, quantum intelligence sub-brain. With a low shout, there seemed to be an immeasurable burst of radiance between the fingers, which suddenly contracted back into a little. Radiance flashed by, only to see a droplet of water suspended in front of him between reality and illusion. It's all true, Zhao Qi murmured to himself. He looked at the water droplet, reached out to grab it, and in the blink of an eye, the droplet disappeared into his palm. The intelligent optical brain has been activated, sincerely serving you, my master. May I ask if you want to start scanning body data? Start scanning. Zhao Qi's mind heard the sound of mechanical synthesis, and he thought for a moment before giving instructions. Understood, scanning is starting. The scanning volume is too large to scan, unable to scan, unable to scan, unable to scan. The mechanical sound in my brain seemed to be intermittent, 
with a feeling of collapse at any moment. Seal all divine and above knowledge in memory, without scanning all mysterious energies, and increase the organization of all knowledge systems in other worlds. Zhao Qi heard the sound in his mind and without hesitation began to control the intelligent operation. Understood, my master. The physical fitness scan is starting, and the 3D model is being organized. The extraction of knowledge from the outer world is starting. Unknown energy has been discovered, cannot be analyzed, and I am giving up. Mysterious knowledge has been discovered, and I am starting to seal it. My master expects the physical fitness scan to be completed in one hour, and the organization of knowledge from the outer world will be completed in 40.6 hours. Please be patient and wait. Connect to the real internet, download the mystical knowledge comprehensively, and compare it with the mystical knowledge in the brain. Priority should be given to organizing the system of gods from other worlds, with equal power ratios understood, start executing. The voice in his mind slowly faded away, but Zhao Qi knew that all of this was not an illusion, and he really had a heritage from another world. Creator, Creator, I never expected to receive two supreme deities from another world. The divine light in my eyes kept flickering. The god of literature, Denier, is the true name of the deity who brought two supreme deities to Zhao Qi. He is really a pitiful person, Zhao Qi couldn't help but sigh as he thought about the constant act of committing suicide. Dina Iyer and his followers spent their entire lives searching for the Thmeta text. He, along with his followers, firmly believed that this text contained all the mysteries of the multiverse, allowing the life reading it to attain its ultimate divinity. In the mythology of the church, Dina Iyer, the attendant of the Namer Agma, gained divinity by glimpsing a small part of the final scrolls, and from then on, searching and reading the entire scrolls became his goal of effort. Dina Iyer believed that every written record that once existed in the material world may contain scattered fragments of the final scrolls. A single character, a set of words, or even a complete sentence hidden in a great scripture that aligns with the ultimate truth. As the patron saint of artists, enlighteners, cartographers, and secretaries, the king of words and images tirelessly examines all records and creations, seeking his ethereal ideals. After searching for countless years, almost all gods lost faith in the Tmeta text, and even many powerful gods believed that the Tmeta text was Denaire's obsession with crazy scholars' nonsense, just searching for his illusory dreams in his heart, which was completely insane. But in the end, Dina Iyer actually found the Thmeta text. If you don't die, you won't die. The treasure of Thmeta text is also something that your weak divine power can touch. No wonder your main god, Ogmeth Binder, together with dozens of powerful and even great divine powers, beat you to pieces in the end, leaving no trace of your divine power behind. Zhao Qi secretly roast in his heart that Meta text is a kind of jade plate in the flood world, an infinite gem and an infinite glove in the marvel world, and at least a big light ball of the Lord God in the infinite terror world. That toy is not something you can have. You have to sneak around even if you're looking for that, and the result is that the entire divine world is known to everyone. Who dies if you don't die? Can't you still let your main god Ogmethy Binder die for you? It was also because Dean Iyer was powerful enough to extract the creation, creation, and two primitive deities from the final scrolls during the period of being besieged. Unfortunately, the group of gods besieging him has infinite power. Even if the two great deities are present, they cannot avoid the fate of death. But otherwise, all of this wouldn't be cheaper for Zhao Qi. Creation and creation are two primitive deities. According to the explanation left by Dina Iyer, as they are primitive deities, they cannot be grown by low-dot-level forces such as faith. We can only rely on our own understanding or opening up the world to create all things. Or simply destroy all things and let the world return to chaos in order to allow the deity to grow. So I'm not only the god of creation, but also the god of destruction. Zhao Qi couldn't help but let out a sigh in his heart when he saw this. Although the growth of the two deities is difficult, their power can be described infinitely. There is only one sentence, which is, create everything you can imagine. 
As long as the divine power is sufficient, from a multiverse to a quark, as long as you dare to think, then you can create. This is simply more than the main god space. Zhao Qi exclaimed countless times, completely shocked by this power. However, towering buildings rise from the ground, although they will have unlimited power in the future, they are now only two semi-divine pieces. Not to mention creating a multiverse, even if Xiao Qi were to create a person now, he could be drained directly. At least the first creation of humans in the main god space is still free, okay. Why is it so troublesome here? According to Dina Iyer, the two semi-divine stages only have 100 divine powers, exceeding which they will operate and absorb on their own until they reach 200 points before condensing into weak divine powers. The subsequent weak divine powers, medium divine powers, strong divine powers, great divine powers, and supreme divine powers are even more distant, making Zhao Qi's scalp tingle. What can I do with only the 20 points of divine power inherent in the divine grid? It's really headache-inducing. Chapter 2 The brain of earthlings is incomparable to those of the indigenous people. You are listening at NovelFull.audio Just now Zhao Qi has already experimented and created a quantum intelligent brain from the 30th century out of thin air. Although it cost nearly three points of divine power, Zhao Qi still felt it was worth it. What, why did you say you wanted to create him? Just kidding. Think about it, the ancient god of war, Anion, the founder of the Ring of Time, Anjali, the master of original sin and truth, the nightmare Hydra Raelin, the Abyss Master Sauron, and other characters with various extremely powerful titles. Are they the ones who, with the help of the system and intelligent brain, have been promoted and raised, become general managers, become CEOs, marry by Fume, and reach the pinnacle of their lives? These days, if you don't have a brain to travel through a different world, you feel embarrassed to say hello to others. Zhao Qi's thinking had been emitting for an unknown amount of time when he was suddenly awakened by the mechanical sound in his mind. Master, your 3D model data has been scanned, have you expanded it? Unfold it, and, understand, Zhao Qi's mind was filled with a dense stream of data, with countless zeros and ones flashing through his mind. When he opened his eyes again, a picture resembling a game property board appeared before his eyes name. Zhao Qi Race Yellow Race, Han Ethnicity Properties Strength 21, 10, Agility 19, 10, Constitution 11, Spirit 8, Energy Is that all? Zhao Qi couldn't help but ask as he looked at the third-rate attribute board in a third-rate game. Is there any other display? Why is it so simple? Why are spiritual and energy displays just question marks? There is also precise data on creating divine power, and why is the cost of creating items not displayed, master, everything I can scan and analyze is based on my own template, as well as future data accumulation. These cannot be generated out of thin air. It's like this. Zhao Qi touched his chin and asked, how is Danel's memory inheritance and organization going? According to calculations, in about 45 hours, the knowledge data below the gods will be sorted out, and the knowledge above the gods cannot be scanned and analyzed at present. However, according to calculations, after the knowledge base is organized, there is an 86% possibility of analyzing data above the level of gods in terms of performance, so, in 45 hours, you can refresh my data again. In theory, that's the case. I'll go, and smart thinking is not everything. Can you analyze the consumption of creating items? Due to the fact that the creation deity in your inheritance has 20 points of divine power, as long as the master creates a few more items with different energy values, the values can be quickly calculated. It is recommended that the owner create across systems in order to make better comparisons. Crossing the system Zhao Qi thought for a moment and couldn't help but feel a bit difficult. Creating items is not difficult, whether it's the innate treasure on the immortal side, the two-dot way foil on the scientific side, the shrink back cannon, or the light grain. The world tree on the magic side, fate mud board. 
the divine weapon on the other side of the military force. The timeline roaming, dimension exploration, and vector control on the psychic side are all excellent and excellent. But these are all pits. Pit. Pit. Zhao Qi dares to bet that as long as he dares to create these supreme wonders, he will be drained in minutes. Whether it's okay or not, both form and spirit will perish, never reborn. What good should be created? Master, when creating items, you should try your best to create items that are helpful to you and even enhance your divine power. Oh, I'm going, there are so many requirements. At this moment, Zhao Qi remembered something and asked, intelligent brain, search for the knowledge base, open up the world. Does creating all things have to be physical? According to the knowledge base, creating a deity can obtain divine power from several sources. Creation, operation, and destruction can all obtain divine power. The amount of divine power obtained is determined by the scope of the world created by the master. Both reality and illusion can obtain divine power, but the divine power obtained in the illusory world is relatively rare Xi now paused and continued to make mechanical sounds echoing in Zhao Qi's mind. Master, according to calculations, if you want to create a world, you need to consume at least 10,000 points of divine power to create a small world. You only have 17 points of divine power now, not to mention creation, even creating larger stones is a bit difficult. Huh, you underestimate my human brain too much. It's truly the wisdom of mortals. Zhao Qi made a gesture of lifting his glasses and said, Analyze, integrate, create. Come on, virtual world seed. Deezed is a free software that can create and manage small VRMOs from Sword God domain. And the virtual worlds developed with Deezed are all possible to be connected, allowing the same character to roam through countless VRMMs, simply put, Mao Chang Jinyan's Deezed is the game engine, which is the basic data package for game development. It's like various online games. If you want to play various evolved private server versions, you must first have a client for online games. Jinao, prepare to receive the seed dot. Yes, we have discovered an unknown program and are analyzing it. Analysis is ongoing. Analysis is complete. Jinao, how much divine power has been consumed? Consumption 2.006 divine power. Then come on, appear, one of the three artificial deities on earth. The original version of Alaya's precious pearl. An inconspicuous crystal bead quietly floated in front of Zhao Qi. One of the three artificial deities on earth. Alaya, from the book, The Great Crossing of the People, its initial function was very single, nothing more than to seduce souls and create illusions to confuse people, without any direct killing power, its function was extremely weak, but its texture was extremely supernatural, even can be said to be indestructible. When it fell into the hands of humans, it was surprised to find that the texture of this treasure bead was so hard, even with no known method, there is no way to find a way to destroy it. Gradually, through research and development, it was discovered that the texture of this precious pearl is indestructible, so it can be infinitely refined. The power increase is almost unlimited, but of course, the increased power is limited to the power of the illusion series. Immediately after, a very ingenious scientist created the first virtual space device in human history based on the characteristics of this pearl, which could bring a trace of human mind into the magical space inside the pearl. It was no different from the virtual technologies in novels, and even exceeded them. In it, it could change with one's mind, create things out of thin air, and then it was completely uncontrollable first for military use, then open to the public. Later on, every earthling had a virtual space account dedicated to them, and the only cost was to regularly input their spiritual power to become the support for the virtual space. Spanning 280 years, more than 100 billion human beings spent their entire lives repeatedly refining and forging the first artifact in the history of human civilization to suppress civilization, let the civilization of the earth endure countless crises and remain invincible, thus becoming increasingly brilliant. The Artificial God Alaya, the absolute controller of the human subconscious and dreams, 
is the ultimate tool for suppressing the energy of Earth's civilization and the planet-level specialized extinction weapon. Even the other two artificial gods later on, the Heavenly Way and the Universe, are much inferior to this tool. This is a truly supreme artifact, and its level is extremely low, with great potential for growth. Compared to other supreme artifacts in the later stage, it surpasses and falls behind. It can be said that this is the most suitable artifact for Zhao Qi, there is no one. Now, the original prototype of this artifact is in Zhao Qi's hands, and the glory in glory in the book, The Great Crossing of the People, will eventually reappear, even more dazzling, but the achievement will be Zhao Qi. Chapter 3 Creating a Small World You are listening at NovelFull.audio Let's calculate how much divine power I have. Zhao Qi held the precious pearl in his hand, his eyes flickering with uncertainty, wondering what he was thinking. Master, your divine power is only 3.611 points left. That's right. Zhao Qi's eyes closed slightly, and in an instant, his mind entered the interior of the treasure. A gray mist swirled around Zhao Qi, and with his mind, it transformed into an infinite scene of creatures that could be spewed out at any time to transform into an infinite illusion and confuse the enemy. However, these illusions really have no killing power, and individuals can ignore them. In The Great Crossing of the People, the protagonist originally relied on adding an energy system to it, allowing it to convert the collected energy into the energy needed for sacrificial refining. First, it entered a virtuous cycle, and then, through the efforts of water grinding, it relied on hundreds of billions of people on earth for nearly 300 years to forge sacrificial refining, making it the highest artifact for suppressing all worlds. Zhao Qi doesn't need to do this, because the most powerful energy system can match the breathing of the previous world. And Zhao Qi didn't say he only opened up a world inside, his dream was to make it a truly multiverse. Zhao Qi looked at the gray mist in front of him, reached out and pointed to the three o'clock creative power, which turned into a seven-color divine light and flew out. Then, with a loud bang, the mist in front of him suddenly turned into a paste. The mist swirled endlessly, forming dozens of colorful eddies of all sizes, some as small as slaps and others as big as stars. Everything flows endlessly, with swirls rubbing and rolling against each other, and the sound of collisions roaring loudly. This is the momentum that created the world. I saw the vortex intensifying, boiling and colliding, and its scene language could not describe its severity. Its size was almost Tao. This kind of scene is only visible to Zhao Qi alone. If anyone else had seen it, they would have been thrown to the ground, praising his divine grace like the sea and his divine power like prison. Zhao Qi saw the mist being broken by his own creative light, and the vortices gradually began to scatter and merge. With a touch of his hand, an illusory seed rushed into the vortex. Like a drop of water falling into the boiling oil, the vortex swells up one alveoli after another. The alveoli burst in a series in the vortex, and countless illusory threads constantly intersect and weave in space. A gradually blurry world was woven in Zhao Qi's eyes, and after an unknown amount of time, the earth gradually became clear and thicker, condensed and transformed from illusion to substance, and then evolved into mountains, rivers and streams. The convergence of sky lines has evolved into dots of stars, sun, and moon, shining with light. A small world has already taken shape. As the world took shape, Zhao Qiji felt his body suddenly become much fuller, as if he used to be a sandbox on the beach, and the sea would disperse as soon as it washed away. But now it feels like it has its own foundation, no longer illusory. Master, congratulations on your successful creation. You have gained 30 points of divine power. The voice of Jinao echoed throughout the entire treasure. Where was divine power born? Can you find it? Zhao Qi asked as he looked at the vast world before him. I'm sorry, Master. Divine power is born out of thin air. Due to incomplete inheritance information, we are unable to find its source at the moment. Oh, that's okay, anyway, I will continue to explore the world in the future, and I will always know the source of divine power. 
since I couldn't find it, Zhao Qi didn't take too much responsibility. Looking at the world in front of him, Zhao Qi stretched out his hand and pulled a figure with colorful light from him. Looking carefully, he saw that the figure was exactly the same as Zhao Qi Chang. His face was very clear, but his expression was very stiff, just like a puppet. Zhao Qi said to the figure, I'll leave the rest to you. I know what to do. This is nature. If you finish the work of opening up the world, then my job will naturally be to operate the world. The figure bounced out word by word, speaking with a particularly awkward sound. Zhao Qi waved his hand and said, Don't work too hard, after all, that's the profession of Hongjun Taoist. You may not be able to play well yet. After a while, when I finish handling everything in my hands, we can do anything big. Then you can do whatever you want, and no one can stop you, ha ha ha. You and I are one, and I know everything you know. Why say such nonsense? The figure bounced out while slowly fading away, as if blending into the entire space. Zhao Qi was not curious when he saw this. He shouted at the figure, although he didn't ask you to work too hard, you also need to serve dim sum. At least you need to get the background of the world out. Don't let people know it's fake at first sight. I know. The afterword was faint, but the figure had disappeared. Really, I didn't expect a cold-faced man to come out. Is there still a cold-faced attribute hidden in my soul? Zhao Qi touched his face and thought of something, shivering uncontrollably. Opening his eyes again, Zhao Qi was still sitting on the bed of his rented room, while the precious pearl in his hand shone brightly, no longer the grey and gloomy appearance he had before. Zhao Qi didn't pay much attention to Bao Zhu's current appearance. With a touch of his hand, Bao Zhu disappeared into his heart. Ji now, how long did it take me to open up the virtual world? It took a total of 25 hours and 41 minutes. How long did it take? Upon hearing the answer, Zhao Qi was taken aback. Although he didn't feel like it had taken much time, he didn't expect it to take so long. Well, in the memory of the literary god Dean Iyer, the spiritual world is the most unpredictable, it can happen in a thousand years, in a blink of an eye. Will such things happen again when I enter the virtual world in the future? Zhao Qi asked. No, because the master has opened up a world inside, which is equivalent to placing a coordinate of time and space inside, and the time in the world has started to synchronize with the real world. At this moment, Zhao Qi suddenly remembered that the past 26 hours had passed, which was equivalent to him not communicating with the outside world for a whole day. Zhao Qi picked up his phone, and indeed there was a series of missed calls and SMS reminders on it. Zhao Qi casually flipped through it, most of which were from the company, and a few were called from home. It seems that I need to find a way to solve this problem, otherwise in the future, I will be locked up for 10 or 20 days without being able to contact me, and my family will have to go crazy. Zhao Qi thought to himself and connected his home phone, Hey, Dad, it's me. A calm middle-aged male voice came from the other end of the phone, I know it's you. Why didn't you answer several phone calls yesterday and text messages? What happened to you? Is something wrong with you? Should we go over and take a look? Don't, Dad, don't scare yourself. I just had my phone broken yesterday and just fixed it today. Don't you think I'll just give you a call? After all, what happened to me is too surreal. If I really tell the second old man about these things, Zhao Qi can imagine that the second old man will definitely book a bed for me in the madhouse. So Zhao Qi casually found a reason to deceive his father first. Next, it's my job. Zhao Qi directly called the company director. Zhao Qi. You still know how to call. Do you know how many calls I made to you yesterday? Now you come to the company immediately, you know. Listening to the angry roar of the director on the phone, Zhao Qi smiled. Hello, director, I called today just to tell you that I resigned and won't work anymore. What? Hello, director, you can handle my salary for this month. It doesn't matter if it's there or not. So hang up. Goodbye. 
Zhao Qi casually hung up the phone. It's really a joke. Now Zhao Qi can gather a large amount of money as long as he is willing, whether it's cheating with his brain or creating directly. What do you really want? Why work under someone else and be angry with them? It's really like buying that company directly, and then looking at the faces of that group of people, thinking about it makes people look forward to it, Zhao Qi thought to himself. Chapter 4 Legendary Professions Also Depend on the Environment You are listening at NovelFull.audio However, this idea just flashed through Zhao Qi's mind and he gave up. Are you joking? Zhao Qi believed that as long as he bought the company today, he would have to go to the police station for tea tomorrow. This is not a joke. A huge fortune with unknown origin is enough to let Zhao Qi in. Alas, it's just that I don't have enough power. If I have enough divine power, I can reverse causality, modify other people's memories, and even lift the table directly, which is not impossible. Why bother thinking like this now? It's embarrassing to be so timid even with a little movement Zhao Qi's mind was full of twists and turns, and one idea after another emerged. Master, most of Denier's memories have been sorted out. Should we start reading? Jinao's voice suddenly rang out in Zhao Qi's mind, so fast. According to your calculation, there are still twenty hours left. Because when my master opened up the world, I absorbed some of the overflowing creative power and world atmosphere, resulting in unknown mutations. My calculation and analysis abilities have greatly improved, so I was able to organize most of the memories twenty hours in advance. It's like this. Zhao Qi couldn't help but wonder why the evolution of this intelligent brain has a sense of concentration, which is really speechless. After sorting out, we have now compiled knowledge about the customs, social structure, genealogy of the gods, world environment, and other aspects of the world of gods. The most important of these is the compilation of all legendary professions and inheritances known to the literary god Denier. Among them, there are thirteen core professions. Warrior, Mage, Bard, Paladin, Warlock, Barbarian, Druid, Priest, Assassin, Sagittarius, Scholar, and Pastor. There are a total of 67 legendary professions and 137 ordinary professions, and these inheritances have been sorted out. In addition, there are a total of 41 legendary professions and 29 taboo professions. The memory of the god of literature, Dinair, only has a general impression, and there is no complete data, so it is not recorded. The calculation and organization are now underway, and it is expected to take 26,778 hours to complete, Algo, Danel truly deserves the title of, King of Words and Images. There are so many good things in his memory, it's really amazing. Zhao Qi secretly admired that although Dinair was only a weak divine power, he had become the god of literature for tens of thousands of years. He accumulated wealth over time, which also made an empire greedy. It's a pity that one day it's empty, the gods of death are destroyed, and the kingdom of gods is also non-existent. Even the metatext doesn't know which deity will be cheaper in the end. It's really pitiful. Wisdom brain, can you deduce that I can inherit the profession of a mage? Wearing a mysterious robe, mastering the four elements of earth fire and feng shui, I casually use a legendary spell to destroy the city and recreate the universe. This art style is simply amazing. Master, according to my deduction, due to the different fundamental laws of the two universes, all professional inheritance related to magic cannot be achieved. Unless the master directly modifies the basic parameters of the universe and adds content related to magic, it can only be inherited from these professions. After listening to Jinao's words, Zhao Qi felt like he had been poured a bucket of cold water on his head. Surprisingly, it would be like this. Aren't those legendary professions useless? Is it possible that in the future, one can only rely on creating deities to create those spells? Or, as Jinao said, directly modify the basic parameters of the universe? How many gods do we need to consume? Just think about it, it's all astronomical numbers. Whether it can be achieved in our lifetime is a question. 
Of course not, Jinao replied in Zhao Qi's mind, among the thirteen core professions, warrior, assassin, and barbarian, there are several legendary professions that do not rely on magic but rely solely on flesh and body to explode. Just like the king of the wilderness, legendary barbarian, legendary martial monk, perfect sneaker, and steel knight, these professions can all be promoted through pure physical strength. Oh. According to your statement, in this universe, if we don't rely on my creative divine power, we can only rely on the methods of flesh and body to ascend to the extraordinary. Yes, my master, because no matter how strict the basic laws of this universe are, the physical body is the foundation of human existence. If that's the case, then I have a 98% chance of promoting a legendary physical profession suitable for this universe. It's like this. Zhao Qi touched his chin and asked, Smart brain, how much divine power do I have now? The master still has 31. Six points of divine power. Can you calculate how much divine power is needed to create the human immortal series in the world of Yang Shen? In the world of Yang Shen, the physical bodies of warriors are constantly changing, shattering the vacuum and never dying. In the world of numerous novels, it is also known as a world of high martial arts and high magic. And the most wonderful thing is that the warriors inside do not need to absorb any spiritual energy from heaven and earth. They are completely developing the inherent potential of the physical body, practicing meat, tendons, skin, bones, organs, marrow, and blood. They gradually transform and transform step by step, reaching the realm of becoming a martial saint of the physical body. In the end, they can even transcend the other side and reach an incredible level. This is simply too suitable for Zhao Qi's current situation. Master, according to calculations, the most complete cultivation method of the Human Immortal series requires 230 points of divine power. If one directly creates Human Immortal level combat power, it requires 11,320 points of divine power. So much. Zhao Qi was not too surprised when he received the answer, after all, the power level of Yang Shen was placed there. A human immortal in the world of gods is at least weak divine power, not to mention that there is also a series of realms on top of it, such as the observation of a hundred orifices, the rebirth of blood drops, the ever dot changing, the shattering of vacuum, transcending the other shore, and so on. That doesn't require a complete human immortal cultivation method, just reaching the level of a martial saint, how much divine power is needed. The essence of the first series of human immortal skills is the method of measuring and opening up 1290.6 acupoints and orifices of the whole body, so the martial saint level skills do not need much supernatural power, which should be around 20 o'clock. That's good, Zhao Qi breathed a sigh of relief, fortunately not exceeding his divine spiritual power reserve. Then come out, the great dragon bodhisattva temple. The Great Dragon Bodhisattva Temple is the treasure of the three great Buddhist martial arts in the world of Yang God, second only to the past, present, and future. Because it is one of the few martial arts secret books in the world that can be used for both spiritual and flesh cultivation. Spiritual Cultivation of the Heavenly Dragon Bodhisattva, Martial Cultivation of the Dragon Elephant Fist Seal The Wei Tian Long Bodhisattva is the manifestation of all forces in the world. All changes in the world are constant, only force remains unchanged, only force is supreme, only force is eternal. It can be said that its artistic conception is unparalleled in depth, not dominating the present as in the human immortal secret scripture, the sutra of the Tathagata of the present world, commanding three thousand, and being the only one under the artistic conception. As soon as Zhao Qi finished speaking, the image of a mighty bodhisattva suddenly appeared in his mind. This great bodhisattva, with one foot on a five-clawed two-horned golden dragon and the other on a white elephant, has muscles and muscles all over his body, his eyes glaring angrily, and he doesn't have any weapons in his hands, but he clenches his fist tightly and makes a sudden attack. This great bodhisattva can be said to bring together all the majesty, grandeur, and power in the world. Along with the image of the great bodhisattva, there are also numerous articles. 
The martial arts section covers everything from practicing flesh to exchanging blood, and the spiritual section covers everything from calming the mind to becoming a ghost immortal, without any omissions. Master, Unknown Knowledge Detected Knowledge Organization in Progress, Organization Completed After storage, the owner can watch it at any time. The Master has consumed a total of 26 points of divine power in this creation. Please pay attention to the surplus of divine power, alas, the great dragon bodhisattva view, is good or bad. It means that martial arts only reach the level of a martial saint, and spiritual cultivation only reaches the level of a ghost immortal. It would be even better if it could be further improved. Zhao Qi pursed his lips and thought regretfully. Master, if the great dragon bodhisattva view, is further elevated, you will be sucked by the divine realm to the point of leaving no residue in your creation. What nonsense are you talking about? Just deduce those legendary physical professions well. Yes, Master. 5, Chapter 5 Everything is possessing, just waiting for deity. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. The sky was as dark as ink, and Zhao Qi stood next to a huge and incomparable temple. The temple was lined with Buddhist pagodas, and treasure temples were everywhere. At a glance, one could not even see the end of the building. The Buddha statue, Bodhi tree, golden lotus pond, and incense were everywhere, as if one were in a western paradise. Zhao Qi turned a blind eye to this and bowed to the middle dot aged monk in front of him, displaying the starting style of the dragon elephant fist seal as a bhikkhu seal. The bhikkhus, including beggars, those who break through troubles, those who become monks, those who hold the precepts, and those who fear demons, are the beginning of all practices and all Buddhist teachings. Under a single imprint, Zhao Qi's entire body and bones suddenly formed the sound of monks chanting scriptures. I am the Buddha Buddha, the middle dot aged monk exclaimed with a Buddhist chant. I didn't expect that the benefactor actually has Buddhist understanding. This style of bhikkhu imprint is deeply ingrained in three of them, not inferior to the true disciples in my temple. But if you steal the scripture, the way Tianlong Bodhisattva view, from our temple, I must retract it. That's so offending. The monk didn't say much, raised his right hand high, flipped his hand, as if the entire sky was collapsing towards Xiao Qi. It is the undisclosed secret of the great Zen temple, the vacuum big handprint. I've been guarding against your move for a long time, Zhao Qi burst out in his mouth, and the monk's seal turned into a diamond seal. Diamond treasures, like the solemn crown of a bodhisattva, can break through everything without being harmed. Two seals collided, and the air between the two was torn apart with a hunting sound. Suddenly, it exploded again, causing waves of white air. In the white waves, Zhao Qi felt as if he had been hit head dot on by a truck weighing several tens of tons. The diamond seal in his hand was almost pinched, and he was thrown out more than ten meters away. Amidst the rolling, Zhao Qi's handprint changed, and his body seemed to exist in another world. No force could strike him. In the blink of an eye, Zhao Qi floated down the steps more than ten meters away. His hand print has a divided artistic conception, and the color space is unclear. It is the color space print. All tangible matter is called color, and these substances are all born from fate, and their essence is emptiness. Therefore, color is emptiness. Color and emptiness print out, and all substances are emptiness to Zhao Qi. I didn't expect the benefactor to be able to cast the six seals of the Bodhisattva in, the great heavenly dragon Bodhisattva view, to this extent. I wonder if you can cast the three seals of the dragon and elephant again. The monk sighed softly, then take me again. The space seemed to be bursting with the monk's right hand, and Zhao Qi looked at it. The entire sky seemed to be filled with his palm, and then he pressed down hard. Aren't you confused about the color space and switching between them? Then I'll crush your soul and see how you hide. This is infinite space. Zhao Qi faced such a big move. The magic seal in his hand changed, the Bika seal, the Vitra seal, the color sky seal, the Arhat seal, 
the great bodhisattva seal, and the seal binding room were like rivers surging, and the whole body was swept by the roar. Zhao Qi's bones exploded all over his body, his body suddenly pulled up like a little giant, and he also waved his own move in front of the monk. Dong Shimi Mount Shimi is the most sacred mountain in Buddhist scriptures. Three thousand worlds revolve around this mountain, and countless Buddhas practice on this mountain. And the movement of Shimi is to imagine the scene of the mighty heavenly dragon Bodhisattva exerting infinite strength, shaking the holy mountain of Shimi, and shaking the foundation of three thousand worlds. In a faint moment, Zhao Qi seemed to transform into a massive and majestic golden Bodhisattva, with one arm and a full body full of muscles and muscles, which seemed to shake the Shimi greatly. Zhao Qi's body slowly emitted a deep voice of praise, which gradually became louder and louder. Finally, it turned into a grand, majestic, oppressive, and vibrating voice, force. 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 With a loud bang, two moves collided, and the sky seemed to explode with a thunderbolt. Zhao Qi was seen rolling and falling out several tens of meters away like a broken sack. The blood on his body spilled all over the ground as if he didn't want money. And the monk across from him also felt uncomfortable. His face was pale, and his entire right arm drooped weakly. He saluted with his left hand, saying, My Buddha, the almighty heavenly dragon Bodhisattva's view has already been passed down to its true essence. It's amazing that you can unleash such a powerful mensumi. This is simply not something that an innate martial artist at the dirty level can unleash. It's just a pity that the Almighty One has such insight, but it has been used in evil ways. Stealing martial arts is a taboo in the martial arts world. Please come with me to the temple, benefactor. The monk's left hand was grabbing weakly, and blood spurted out. Zhao Qi was completely sucked into his hand. He he, Zhao Qi said with a smile as he kept spraying blood outside. Yin you monk, you haven't said these things thirty times, you've said them twenty times too. Can we put it another way? How could it be that this is just the first time I've met the benefactor, and these words are also the first time I've said them? How could the benefactor speak like this? Zhao Qilan continued to talk nonsense lazily, shouting to the sky, Master, save this dungeon and lead me back. Got it. There was a strange jumping sound in the sky. Then the whole world froze, as if someone had pressed the pause button. Whether it was the great Zen temple or the Yin Moon monk, they all became objects in amber, particularly eerie. A white light flashed by, and Zhao Qi disappeared into this world. Congratulations, my lord. It's the first time that you escaped from Monk Inue. In a magnificent temple, Zhao Qi and a man in golden and white robes sat side by side on the throne of the temple. After a closer look, they were exactly the same. Are you praising me or hurting me? Zhao Qi couldn't resist roast. Since I created the small replica world of the Great Zen Temple with sixteen points of magic combined with the seed of the virtual world, how many times have I been killed by the monk Inue with one move, do you know? Twenty-six times. It's not like death for his mother. This time, if I didn't want to see through the movement of vitality, I would be killed by two moves. I really don't understand. It's clear that we should be in the same realm. Did I make a mistake, master, this is impossible. The mechanical sound of the intelligent brain echoed in the temple. Master, after my scan, your physical fitness should be on the same level as that of the Indian moon monk. Even because you have created a large number of rare spiritual medicines to take, your pure and rich chi and blood should be far above that of the Indian moon monk. How could you be killed with just one move? All right, Jinao, stop talking. Expand my current attributes. Yes, master. As soon as the words fell, a attribute page appeared in front of Zhao Qi. Come, let me take a look. What kind of attribute is this one now? Zoom in on that attribute page, said the person sitting on the other side. Yes. Name. Zhao Qi Race. Yellow Race, Han Ethnicity Occupation. 
Creator Level 0, Demigod. Martial Artist Level 4, Practicing Visceral Level Innate Martial Artist Bloodline. Nothing Skills. Dewei Tian Long Bodhisattva View, Vacuum Big Handprint, Properties. Strength 210, 10, Agility 160, 10, Constitution 173, 11, Spirit 248, 8, Energy. 87 points of creative divine power own a virtual world. 3 Heavenly Realm, Human Realm, Earthly Realm, and Dungeon World. 2 Copies of the Great Zen Temple, a copy of the literary god Denier's Divine Kingdom, Master, that's all for your specific attributes. Simply put, this attribute is incredibly gorgeous. Not to mention the profession of the Creator God alone, it can blind countless people's eyes. And all other attributes are about 20 times that of an ordinary person, which is equivalent to Zhao Qi going out wearing red underwear, so he can impersonate Superman. Not to mention that he is still practicing innate martial arts at the visceral level. In the world of Yang Shen, practicing at the visceral level strengthens the internal organs through breathing and breathing, with continuous and profound breathing, long physical strength, walking as fast as a galloping horse, jumping as agile as a flying bird, and almost capable of defeating a hundred people. In reality, Zhao Qi is simply a living bug. Ji now, how did you do with what I asked you to do? Zhao Qi looked at a tribute and suddenly asked. Master, according to your instructions, I have registered a small online company called Infinite World in China, and have also registered an official website online, which is ready to operate at any time. How are you doing here, Lord? Zhao Qi asked the person next to him. My Lord, everything is similar. The three major worlds have all been transformed, and the specific story background has been set. Only the last step is needed to make the world run normally. Which step? Zhao Qi said curiously. Divide the three realms into divine positions, let the world run on its own. The main god grinned at Zhao Qi. Chapter 6 The God of Literature, the You are listening at NovelFull.audio Function Zhao Qi snorted lightly and said, Function The first person people think of is the guy surnamed Jiang, who is also known as Zia. At the age of over 90, he only emerged from the mountains and could only live a life of wealth and prosperity, without the pitiful urging of fate. Yeah, if you hadn't opened up four more worlds in the past half month, I wouldn't have thought about it. The guy named Lord God, who was actually Zhao Qi's soul divider, couldn't help but complain. It was also Zhao Qi's fault to say so. After all, the task given to the main god at that time was only to operate the rules of a virtual world. However, due to his lack of divine power, Zhao Qi opened two more virtual worlds, which directly increased his workload by three times and almost prevented the main god from exploding his soul on the spot. Later, due to the need to practice martial arts, Zhao Qi wanted to open up a world of young gods. If it weren't for the main god desperately pulling him, he probably wouldn't know where he died long ago. Even so, Zhao Qi opened up a world of large Zen temple dungeons. In order to reduce the pressure on the main god and make the dungeon more realistic, Zhao Qi invested a full 16 points of divine power. You should know that opening up a virtual world for Zhao Qi only costs 3 to 4 points of divine power. However, both effort and gain are proportional. For that small dungeon, when it runs every day, the divine power feedback to Zhao Qi is on par with those three virtual worlds. It was precisely because of this discovery that Zhao Qi, excited, opened up another dungeon world. This time, he did a big job and directly used 30 divine powers. As a result, he didn't even have a fart because Zhao Qi found that his creative deity could only accept the divine power feedback from four worlds, and any more would be a waste. If you want to increase the upper limit of acceptance, you can only wait until the level of the creation deity is increased. This is really a sad story, Lord, are you listening to me? I know, I know. Zhao Qi waved his hand, how many gods do you want to seal? Don't have 365 Zhou Tian Jing gods, 84,000 star Sha Vice gods, and so on. 
If that's the case, my divine power alone cannot withstand consumption. I'm going, you really dare to speak up. Even if you dare to go crazy, where can I find so many people to make you shut down? After hearing Zhao Qi's full mouth, the main god almost jumped off the throne. I tell you, my idea is the Trinity, the three supreme masters of creation, fate, and destruction, who control the entire multiverse. As long as these three gods return to their positions, I can at least reduce half of the pressure. If we could separate the six basic elements of earth fire, feng shui, light, and darkness, it would be even better. As for humanitarian deities like war and desire, they can be sealed or not, and they cannot affect my operation of the world. In that case, I have plans, Zhao Qi thought for a moment, feeling a draft in his heart. I have opened up a virtual multiverse and am undoubtedly the god of creation. The main god operates the universe, weaving the fate and causality of all beings, and can be regarded as the god of fate. It is difficult for the god of destruction, so I cannot separate another soul, which will make me old. The god of destruction destroys the world and cleanses multiple sins, which is an indispensable existence. However, he must be extremely clear-headed and ideally have complete values of the three concepts. Otherwise, if he goes crazy, my losses will be huge. No, no, we need to find a more stable one Zhao Qi's mind was spinning, and suddenly thought to himself, but if it's that one, it should be possible. After thinking for a moment, Zhao Qi reached out and tore open the space in the temple, jumping into it. I'll go and come, Lord, please wait a moment. Zhao Qi had just stepped into this world, and when he looked around, there were rows and rows of bookshelves filled with books. However, what Zhao Qi saw was at least a thousand rows, and what he couldn't see was even more. At the deepest part of these bookshelves, there is a small desk placed there. On the desk, an old man wearing a scholar's robe is helping him read. Dean Iyer, are you becoming a literary old man again? Zhao Qi couldn't help but smile as he looked at the old man. Since Zhao Qi spent 30 points of divine power to create the Denier Divine Kingdom dungeon, as long as Zhao Qi came, Denier would definitely be sitting on a desk reading, and there has never been a second image. Oh! It's the Creator God here. The old man saw Zhao Qi's arrival and quickly stood up, respectfully bowing to him. No, no, I just came over to take a look. Zhao Qi looked at the old man bowing, feeling particularly uncomfortable. After all, I only reached this point through the legacy of Cornell. It's not an exaggeration to say that without Cornell, Zhao Qi wouldn't even be a fart. Creator God, you're joking. After all, I'm just a phantom of the literary god Denier that you created, and I can't be considered as Denier. The old man didn't care about what he was created for and said it calmly. I can't say that. You were created by me, that's right. But you have all the memories of Dina Iyer in your mind, and your personality was also created by me based on Dina Iyer. You can be said to be the god of literature, Dina Iyer. Who can object? Creator, your words are so domineering. Who can oppose your decision in this world? Whatever you say is what you say. The old man did not agree with Zhao Qi's words much, showing a lack of interest. After he was created, he kept thinking about a question, which was who he really was, whether he was the god of literature, Denier, or just a phantom of him. He sat in the kingdom of God thinking incessantly, but couldn't figure it out. Zhao Qi has some understanding of the old man's thoughts, but he doesn't have a good way to reshape his personality. Denel, I came today to find you for something. Creator, just say it and I will definitely complete the task you gave me. I hope you can be the god of destruction in this virtual world. Denel, dot. Without waiting for Dina Iyer to answer, Zhao Qi asked, Dina Iyer, what do you think of my world? Unbelievable, a divine tool that can create a world with nothingness is simply amazing. Even in the world of gods, there are no more than two fingers of such power. So being a god of destruction in this world shouldn't be considered unfair to you. Don't be wronged, don't be wronged, 
Daener's eyes gradually brightened as he achieved the highest position of destruction in this world. Although it was only illusory, only by refining falsehoods and achieving the true world, would he be the true supreme god. Dina Iyer would definitely be willing to have such an opportunity. So that's good, you can not only be the king of words and images, but also the master of destruction and sin. Zhao Qi patted Daener's shoulder, as if everything was up to you. Dina Iyer, by the way, how did you organize the knowledge of the other world that I asked you to organize? Can those extraordinary powers be used in the main world? Zhao Qi asked, Well, I have discussed this matter with the main god and the intelligent brain, and we believe that extraordinary powers are difficult to use due to unnecessary factors. What factor can I create directly? It's difficult. Dina Iyer shook his head, If you want to create this factor directly, then you have to confront the basic laws of the entire universe, and you may be crushed by these basic laws in an instant. What should we do? Have you come up with a solution? Well, I've thought about it, Danelle nodded. That's what the Lord God thought of. He said since we can't do it directly, let's take a detour. We can put all the mystery into your artifact. When you bring the spirit of all beings to the world you have opened up, with the invasion of the spirit of all beings, your artifact can also be considered a part of this universe. In this way, we have a lot of articles to write about, mystery and transcendence will not be dreams. Chapter 7 Fongshen Fongshen You are listening at NovelFull.audio Dina Iyer said these words with a golden light in his eyes, clearly feeling very uneasy inside. After more than half a month of understanding this world, he found that it was a world with extremely strict physical rules and no gaps. As a madman said, there is no place left for God in this world. In the same world, there is no room for mystery. If Xiao Qi wants to transcend in this universe, he must collide with this world. As for whether to die or live, it is unknown. But now, through their deduction, things have taken a great turn. As long as they can draw the will of sentient beings into Zhao Qi's artifact, then this artifact can also be considered a part of this universe. Since it has become a part of the rules, it would be too helpful for Zhao Qi. Hmm. Zhao Qi pointed at Dina Iyer and said, Let's go meet the others and officially grant you the throne of destruction. Without saying much, the two of them reached out and tore open the space of the Divine Kingdom dungeon, returning to the temple. When the main god saw Dina Iyer brought by Zhao Qi, he couldn't help but complain to Zhao Qi about, This is the god of destruction you are looking for. Let a king of words and images be the god of destruction, and the main god has a big hole in your brain. Haha, <laughs> there is no way, it's really impossible to find a suitable candidate than him. After all, he has been a real god, which is not comparable to our grass team. Zhao Qi laughed and laughed at himself. Creator God, you're joking. Danel wouldn't dare to take Zhao Qi's words, wouldn't that be killing him? He respectfully bowed to the main deity, saying, Great fate, I greet you and wish you eternal health. No need to be so polite. In the future, our three gods will have equal positions and jointly control this virtual universe, without any distinction of size. The main deity looked at Zhao Qi and said, Do you mind if I say that? What's wrong with this? I created you all in the hope that you could become a real life, just a virtual universe. What's there to mind? Zhao Qi clearly saw some of their thoughts, so he reassured them. Zhao Qi is indeed telling the truth. He holds two supreme deities of creation and creation, and how could the future be limited to a virtual universe? Even now, he just sees it as a springboard, not his job. Whether the Lord God and Danel succeed or fail, Zhao Qi will only bless them and not interfere recklessly. To put it bluntly, although this virtual world has great potential, it is just a dojo inside a snail's shell. It shatters with just a pinch of a real powerhouse. All right, all right, stop talking nonsense. Dina Iyer, let me ask you one more question. Are you willing to inherit destruction, become the master of destruction, the master of sin, 
and bear the cause and effect of the entire virtual world. As Zhao Qi spoke, his clothes moved without wind, and hunting made a sound. Amidst the commotion, Zhao Qi's voice seemed to come from beyond heaven, asked by the whole world. I am willing to bear the sins and causes of the whole world, and fulfill my duty seriously. Dina Iyer knelt in front of Zhao Qi, lowered his head, and answered the inquiry from beyond with seriousness. Very well, now you are the god of destruction, whose position is equal to mine. Zhao Qi's words were not finished, and the void emitted a joyful emotion. The concept of destruction condensed on Denair's body, and soon a dark golden ancient scepter appeared in front of him. This was the collection of destruction, a symbol of sin. Dina Iyer held his scepter, feeling the whole world tremble, fear, and retreat. With a gentle wave of the Dina Iyer scepter, he isolated himself from the whole world, and thus the trembling of the world ceased. Zhao Qi didn't pay much attention to Denair's movements either. He turned his head to look at the Lord God and said, Lord God, are you willing to inherit fate, become the weaver of fate, and take on the responsibility of running the world and guiding sentient beings? I am willing to take on such a responsibility. The Lord God had already knelt down and, facing Zhao Qi's inquiry, he said cautiously, After all, I run the entire world and lead all living beings. Life is endless, and the responsibility is not limited. Very well, you should be the Lord God of destiny, whose position is equal to mine. The words fell, and infinite concepts of fate woven and intersected in front of the Lord God. Soon, a grey scroll fell into the hands of the Lord God. The main deity opened the scroll and suddenly it spread, enveloping the entire world. With a gentle touch, the scroll reappeared in the hands of the main deity, as if nothing had happened just now. Unconsciously, Zhao Qi's aura of creation grew stronger and stronger, with endless sun, moon, and stars faintly visible. The multiverse was born and died around him, and with every move, his aura overwhelmed the two main gods of fate and destruction. The concept of endless creation converged in front of Zhao Qi, and soon a blurry knight's long sword was about to take shape in front of Zhao Qi. Zhao Qi stretched out his hand and scattered the knight's long sword, saying, I don't like this kind of creation artifact, let's switch to a different type. Void asked and explored, but at least another creation artifact condensed together. This is a weapon that existed before the concept of the sword was born. It does not have the usual concept of a blade, the head is not a sharp part, the sword body is circular and divided into three sections, rotating in reverse with the sword handle as the axis. The concepts of creation and destruction coexist, and this is the obedient sword Ea. They are believed to originate from the great god Ea, Enki, who is the god of Mesopotamian and Babylonian mythology, and from the narrative poem of the Book of Genesis in Babylonian mythology. Zhao Qi held on to the golden hilt of the obedient sword, and in a daze, the three circular sections of the sword rapidly rotated around each other. The indescribable power condensed around Zhao Qi, and the concept of creation gave it a power that was no less powerful than in mythology. In front of this force, Jin Shanshan so dot called creation of heaven and earth is just a joke. Zhao Qi calmed down, and the rotation of his obedient sword slowly stopped. The terrifying aura of creation also gradually dissipated. Now, what are you doing with nothing to open the sky? You can't convert your divine power, and you have to put in a lot of real loss making deals. Zhao Qi thought to himself, finally stopping this effort. The other two supreme gods finally breathed a sigh of relief at this moment. The destructive scepter and destiny scroll in their hands gradually relaxed. In just a moment, they even felt the atmosphere of falling. It can be imagined that if Xiao Qigong had just swung that blow, forget it, let's not think about it. The two supreme gods simultaneously voluntarily forgot about this dangerous idea. Since the three gods have returned to their positions now, let's work together to create those six elemental gods, Xiao Qi suggested as he looked at the two gods. Very good, very good. The main deity and Dina Iyer both nodded and said that they had just obtained their highest artifacts, and could just test their power. 
In the emptiness outside the world where the three of them walked, let's start. Dina Iyer forcefully smashed his scepter into the void, and for a while, large pieces of emptiness were smashed into disorderly air currents. Zhao Qi followed closely behind, and the three rotations of his obedient sword gave this void the possibility of creation. The fate scroll in the Lord's hand opened up, wrapping the entire piece inside. So let fate decide in the end. The disordered and infinite possibilities of the air currents in the scroll transformed into one small time and space, and countless lives rapidly evolved and disappeared under the weaving of fate. Once again, they evolved and disappeared, and soon there were six powerful beings. The elemental life stands out from within. The Lord God reached out and shook his hand, and the six lives shook out of the scroll. Once more, the scroll wrapped countless small spaces and fell into the Lord God's hands. The task is completed, Lord, please grant them divine titles. Zhao Qi nodded and pointed to the light element, saying, You should be the god of the sun and light in this world. I will give you the name Pelayer. Pointing at the dark element, he said, You shall be the god of death and darkness in this world. Give you the name Jurgal. Pointing to the earth element, he said, you should be the god of this earth and nature, and give you the name Grumber. Pointing to the element of fire, he said, you should be the god of fire and civilization in this world, and bestow upon you the name Kasuth. Pointing to the wind element, he said, you should be the god of storms and disasters in this world, and give you the divine name Taros. Pointing to the element of water, he said, you should be the god of the ocean and life in this world, and give you the name Istitia. As soon as Zhao Qi finished speaking, the six elemental origins condensed on the six of them, and soon six elemental artifacts were condensed and mastered by them one by one. At this moment, the Lord God spoke up and said, Your six gods should have taken it upon themselves to protect the world and assist us, the three of us, in running the world. If you relax, you will surely bring us down to the mortal world and return us to the source of heaven and earth. Do you understand? We will keep our oath to the world and never let it be in danger. Upon hearing the words of the Lord God, all six gods felt a chill in their hearts and quickly swore to him. Then enter the world to fulfill your divine duties. Yes. The six gods dared not speak much, so they transformed into six divine lights and rushed into the world. The main deity closed his eyes and felt for a moment before saying to the two, Don't worry with those six laborers, my stress has really decreased a lot. I only have less than 30% of the original stress left, and I estimate it will have to decrease in the future. That was you who scared them. Do I think it's necessary to scare them like this? Denier laughed. The plan doesn't wait for anyone. Everything is ready now, but we can't ruin big things just because of the six of them. Upon hearing Zhao Qi's words, both the main deity and Denaire's expressions became extremely serious. After all, the matter was of great importance, and one could not be too careful. Since that's the case, I have no objections. I don't have either. It's been some time since the three finally exchanged their opinions and suggestions. That's good, Jinao. Yes, Master. Let's start executing the plan for Infinite World. Yes, my master. Chapter 8 Shi De Pu Ben, congratulations on the official launch of Infinite Game. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. I don't know when it started. In the computers of individuals and individuals of all sizes in China, whenever someone visits a web page, a junk page always pops up saying, the highly anticipated unlimited game is about to be released for public testing. Now you can claim an activation code and a mysterious gift package. What are you waiting for? Come and play now. Where is this trash game from? It bounces out every day, making me lose my passion for playing League of Legends. The internet monitor doesn't care about it, it's too popular, right? Ji Ching skillfully closed the web page and cursed inwardly. I don't know what's going on with this web page and no matter what method is used, there is no way to intercept it. 
Ji Ching even redone the computer system several times because of this web page, but it still doesn't work. When he opens the web page, it still pops up. Ji Cheng asked several of his close friends and found that although they also had such web pages popping up on their computers, they didn't happen frequently, only two or three times a day. It's not like him popping up hundreds of times a day. Ji Cheng hated it so much that he wanted to smash his computer. Huh, Ji Cheng is competing with your broken computer again. The QQ message lit up, displaying the information of his friend Wang Kong. Yeah, in just a few moments, I closed that broken web page three times. Come on, come on, let's take advantage of our free time and chat a few more. Good idea, I'll open the room now. Same as above. When I saw Wang Kang's message, a few good friends came forward and prepared to start filming. You go ahead first, and I'll come find you when I close those junk web pages. Ji Ching just finished typing the information quickly and saw one page after another constantly refreshing. Is it over or not? Let's not let anyone pass. Ji Cheng looked at the web page that occupied the entire computer screen and couldn't help but howl. With a fierce heart, he clicked into the web page and said, I want to see what tricks you can play. If not, I'll just do the system. Ji Cheng was already ready and as soon as he entered the web page, the system was ready to crash. But when I actually entered, nothing happened. A set of numbers appeared on the web page, along with a paragraph saying, please keep your activation code safe. This game will officially open in the early hours of tonight, please pay attention to the time. What are you joking about? It will open in the early hours of tonight. If someone enters, then there will be a ghost. Ji Ching sneered and closed the web page, but by a stroke of luck, he recorded that set of activation codes. It's strange to say that when Ji Ching really clicked on the web page and exited, the web page never refreshed again, as if everything before was just his illusion. Hello, Ji Ching, is it okay? You're just one person away. Are you still coming? Wang Kang's QQ messages kept flashing, startling Ji Cheng. Here we are, what's the rush for? Ji Ching quickly shook off the feeling he had just felt. Now that the world was vast, he gave him a big masturbation. At 12 o'clock in the evening, Ji Ching was still struggling on the computer desk, as for the infinite game. I never knew where he had forgotten. When the needle pointed at 12 o'clock, the entire computer suddenly went black. Damn it, what's going on? Is the computer broken now? Ji Cheng was surprised. Before he could even speak, he felt like he was sucked into the computer and heard the sound of electronic machinery in his ear. Infinite Game is officially launched now, I wish players a happy time, thank you. He fainted as soon as he heard the whole person. When Ji Cheng regained consciousness, he was immediately stunned by the sight before him. He saw a deity sitting in a vast, vast, and vast universe. The deity held a scroll in his hand, in which countless stars were born and died. Upon closer inspection, those stars were clearly one world after another. Ji Cheng was completely shocked. He didn't expect to see such scenes that were not even seen in mythology. Who exactly is this, how could he have such great power? Before Ji Cheng could ask, the divine figure's scroll shook slightly, and Ji Cheng threw himself into it. Can't you, come again? Ji Cheng fainted again after speaking. Where am I? The vague Ji Cheng felt like he was lying on a carriage, and the less violent jolt quickly made him wake up. I saw him lying in a small horse carriage, with a creature resembling a fairy floating quietly not far from him. After seeing Ji Cheng wake up, the creature quickly flew up to him and said, Dear player, hello, I am System 24468. Welcome to participate in the unlimited game. Where am I, can I still go back? Ji Cheng heard the elf's words and quickly asked him the question he most wanted to know. Although he enjoys reading fantasy novels about time travel, if he really wants to travel, without a phone or computer, he will have to commit suicide in less than three days. Don't worry, player. 
my purpose here is to solve your doubts. Firstly, you are currently in a world within the infinite world opened up by the Creator God. Secondly, you can go back at any time, as long as you silently recite, return, in your heart, you will receive a reminder. The little elf spoke these words like a chant. After listening to the little elf's words, Ji Cheng's heart inexplicably calmed down. He silently recited, return, in his heart. Just as he finished, he only heard the electronic sound of the model in his ear, Dear player, do you want to quit the unlimited game now? If you quit, you will be banned from entering this game for 24 hours, yes or no? No, Ji Cheng hesitated without hesitation. After more than a decade of continuous cultivation by Qingdian, how could Ji Cheng not have imagined that this was the greatest opportunity in his life? Infinite Space Nightmare City Devil's Island Or other main god worlds Ji Cheng murmured to himself, only he could hear it. The voice of the little elf continued to ring, this game is created by the joint efforts of the three supreme gods, with endless opportunities inside. As long as players work hard, there are infinite possibilities. So how can we obtain these opportunities? Ji Cheng asked. Participate in this world, strive to integrate into it, and as long as you work hard, you can obtain the divine coins gifted by the Supreme God, which is the only currency that can purchase infinite wonders. Infinite wonders. What is that? That is a list, and the items on the list are infinite wonders. Every morning, the Supreme God refreshes the list, so you need to work hard. Don't easily gather enough divine coins, but miss them because of the refresh. How can you see that list? Ji Cheng asked again. It's easy, just silently recite the strange things list, in your heart. List of strange things. Ji Cheng silently recited in his heart. Suddenly, a list appeared in front of him, and Ji Cheng only glanced at it and couldn't move his gaze. The top spot on the list is Peng Lai Medicine, taken for immortality, immortality, and immortality. Derived from the world's twelfth level wonder of Oriental Fantasy Town, worth one million divine coins, can be brought into reality. Damn it, this thing can even appear, that's too foul, right? Ji Ching couldn't help but feel a shock in his heart when he saw this strange thing, and let out a vulgar sentence. Ji Cheng can be certain that if those billionaires in reality knew about this, they would have gone bankrupt and had to get it. Immortal, immortal. That is the most primitive desire engraved deep in human genes, hope. Now in front of me, who can calm down? Unfortunately, the dazzling one million divine coins deeply blocked him. Thinking about it, he knew that what the divine coins had obtained must be extremely high. If he wanted to raise one million, he could only rely on dreaming. Ji Ching pursed his lips and shifted his gaze to another place. Universe Rubik's Cube, Thunder God Hammer, Earth Element Spirit Pill, Red Emperor Blood, Two-Way Foil, Retraction Cannon, and so on are all level 10 or above creatures that can trigger a world war if they appear in reality. Unfortunately, I don't have a single divine coin on me. At this moment, Ji Ching suddenly thought of something and asked, I still have an activation code on me. What's the use of it? The activation code can activate a small gift package. Is it activated? Confirm activation. Upon hearing this, Ji Cheng was immediately excited and didn't know what it might be. Dear player, you have received a small gift package. Do you want to open it? Open. Congratulations, player. You have obtained one inch genuine bone making pill and ten divine coins. Please continue to work hard. The Qianyuan bone making pill is a unique fourth level item from the world of Immortal Hulu, which transforms and eliminates all diseases. Dear player, my mission has been completed. Please explore this world on your own. Goodbye. As soon as I finished speaking, the little elf disappeared. Hello, I still have a lot of questions to ask. Why did you run away so quickly? Chapter 9 Test 
You are listening at NovelFull.audio. At this moment, the continuously advancing carriage finally came to a stop. Ji Ching got off the carriage and found himself standing in front of a vast college. He turned his head to look at the carriage and realized that what he was driving was a humanoid mechanical puppet. It seems that you are the student who came to our Architect Knights Academy. Let's go, it's only you left. A strong man in armor walked out from the entrance of the academy. He looked at Ji Cheng, seemingly disappointed, but didn't say much. He reached out and was ready to pull Ji Cheng in. At this moment, Ji Cheng's ear was ringing with the electronic sound of the system, Attention players, are you sure you want to join the Architect Knights Academy? If you don't join, you will become a free person. If you join, you will have to abide by the rules of the Architect Knights Academy, otherwise you will be expelled from the Academy. Upon hearing the system prompt, Ji Cheng calmly chose to confirm joining, allowing the tower-like strong man to drag him into the Academy. Since you plan to participate in this unlimited game, you must understand its background environment in order to obtain as many divine coins as possible. No matter how much a person inquires about information, how can they compare to the power of the collective? Joining the Architect Knights Academy is undoubtedly the best choice. I saw the strong man take Ji Cheng to a large playground with a huge statue standing tall. There were about a hundred people standing sparsely on the playground. Ji Cheng looked carefully and found that these people were just like him, all players. You stay here for a while. When everyone arrives, we will give a unified lecture. The strong man finished speaking and threw him here. Hey brother, did you also come in to play games? Just as Ji Cheng was feeling a bit lost, a chubby man in his twenties walked over and asked Ji Cheng with a smile, Why, you too? That's not true. I was brought in by this game while watching a romantic action movie, and it scared me so much at the time. I think it scared you, right? A young man with glasses next to him couldn't help but laugh. I can't tell that you have this hobby with a simple and honest face. Go there, what's so surprising? Who hasn't done this before, chubby guy? He didn't pay much attention to the ridicule of the young man. He squinted his eyes and said, I just didn't expect this to be a truly infinite world. You don't know, when I saw that deity, I was really scared and didn't even know how I got in. After listening to the fat man's words, the people around also had feelings of concern. The divine power could not be described in words, and even now it is extremely shocking. I don't know what the name of that deity is, some people around couldn't help but sigh. Why, do you still want to confess to him? Maybe it's just fake, someone asked curiously. Hee <laughs> hee, several sneers came from around. Ji Ching couldn't help but shake his head after hearing these words. How could there still be such a mentally disabled person? The world they are currently in is the greatest proof of the existence of that deity. Anyone who doesn't have a brain injury knows that this is simply a real world. If I'm not mistaken, that deity should be the fate god, one of the three highest gods, interjected a handsome middle school student. Just now, I asked the people here about the creation myth of this world and found that only the description of the fate god fits the image of the deity we see. The creation god should be the image of a young boy, and the destruction god should be an elderly person. Moreover, the fate god's supreme artifact. The fate scroll, which is the one that envelopes countless worlds we saw at that time, should be the one that the middle school student's eyes clearly showed a hopeful expression. You're really a middle school student, haven't you passed the second phase of this middle school? The young man with glasses laughed again, what kind of artifact can you imagine? If it were placed in the wilderness, then the picture scroll would at least be a treasure at the level of innate treasure. If I had to tell you, our biggest thing now is to earn that divine coin. The strange items on the list can be brought into reality. That's the capital for us to live and survive. The words of the young man with glasses completely scratched everyone's itch, and thinking about it, I also know what kind of result would be if any of the items on the list were brought to reality. Penglai Medicine, Earth Element Spirit Pill, Red Emperor Blood, 
these immortal elixirs that greatly improve one's cultivation and increase one's lifespan need not be said much. They are the first level 6 wonder, cold fusion arc reactor initial edition, inside. If they really appear in reality, then the sixth energy revolution will really begin. In simple words, as long as they can buy the initial version of the cold fusion arc reactor, their dreams of promotion, salary increase, becoming the general manager, CEO, marrying by Fume, and reaching the pinnacle of life can truly be realized. Just as everyone was daydreaming, imagining owning billions of divine coins, buying what they liked, buying what they didn't like, and buying what they both liked and didn't like. That kind of day is simply not worth it. Do we have magic coins now? At this time, a voice broke the illusion of everyone, who is this? What's the big truth? Don't you see that the pot of water hasn't been boiled yet? What are you talking about? Many people were crazy about roast in their hearts. Ji Ching pretended to casually glance at the crowd and found that although many people showed embarrassment, there were still a few who showed some lightness, while the fat man and the young man with glasses stood out. Ji Cheng, who had a similar expression, knew that these individuals probably had gained something from the activation code. I just don't know what strange things they have obtained, but don't have any extraordinary things, otherwise it would be too frustrating, Ji Cheng thought to himself. Is it also because everyone doesn't know what Ji Cheng is thinking, otherwise he would have gone crazy with anger. He possesses a level 4 wonder that can transform people and eliminate all illnesses, yet he is afraid of others having supernatural wonders. He himself is the most supernatural being. Because in Zhao Qi's plan, those players who rely on activation codes can obtain the highest level of magical items, at least a few divine coins, and even the comfort of single-digit divine coins that the vast majority of people only receive. Of course, Ji Ching didn't know about these, so he continued to think. All right, everyone, take a look. At some point, the Iron Tower-like strong man appeared again among the crowd, clapping his hands to gather them. Seeing many people showing indifferent expressions, the strong man's gaze froze and he shouted loudly, as if a thunderbolt had exploded in everyone's ears for a moment. Those people were trembling with fear, their faces pale, and many sat on the ground. The strong man didn't pay much attention to those people, so he spoke up and said, I won't say much about your origins. I'm sure you all know it yourself. But Architect Knight's Academy is not that easy to enter, and you must go through a test. If it doesn't work, then you should go back. The strong man's words caused a stir among the crowd, but it quickly subsided. The strong man looked at it and nodded in satisfaction, very good. It seems that everyone has no objections, so let's start. The strong man walked up to the huge statue and respectfully prayed, great god of fire and civilization, Cassus. We must reform the world with fire and guide civilization with fire. Amidst the sound of prayer, a fiery divine text appeared on the statue, and the dazzling divine power flashed away. The surrounding people couldn't help but close their eyes. When they opened their eyes, they were already standing on a plane, and a large group of soldiers were faintly approaching from afar. At this moment, Ji Chang's system crazily flashed a prompt sound, Attention players, you have been swept by the divine power of the Fire and Civilization Divine Card Bureau. Attention players, you have been teleported to a certain mirror instance by the divine power of the Fire and Civilization Divine Card Bureau. Attention players, you have been swept by the divine power of the Fire and Civilization Divine Card Bureau. In this mirror instance, you temporarily have a second level martial arts skill, the black iron body, and a first level skill, the heavy strike. Attention players, in this mirror instance, once you die, it will be automatically teleported, and all skill memories will be cleared. Seize the opportunity. All right. I think you all have received the divine gifts of the god of fire and civilization, so your test is to survive from this large group of soldiers. The strong man paused for a moment, the god of fire and civilization in this world has always been watching here. If you behave perfectly, there is no possibility of receiving divine favor or gifts, even the god of fire and civilization will not be stingy with what you call divine coins. 
All right, without further ado, you don't have much time, may you all have good luck. The strong man finished speaking and disappeared. Leave a hundred or so people here to peer at each other. 10, Chapter 10 Nights Marshall Monk You are listening at NovelFull.audio Ji Ching didn't have the heart to argue with these people either. He closed his eyes and wanted to feel the two skills bestowed by the god of fire and civilization. Just as he remembered them, he only felt that there were long paragraphs of text in his mind, from breathing tips to power techniques, and even methods to break through physical limits and condense extraordinary spiritual light, all of which were mentioned in words and phrases. Not only that, he even felt extremely familiar with two skills, as if he had practiced them for more than a decade, and even with his eyes closed, he could even play them. What kind of skill is this? It's clearly a true martial arts skill. The god card of fire and civilization is too generous, isn't it? Just give it to us casually. Ji Cheng suppressed his excitement. The most important thing now is to survive this test, otherwise everything will be in vain, and nothing will be discussed. Feeling the surging power in his body, Ji Cheng burst into laughter. As the saying goes, those who obstruct my path may give way or die. The power bestowed by the Lord of Fire and Civilization, Ji Cheng, is about to be determined. Let's go then, Ji Cheng twisted his wrist and watched as the team of people came to kill in a grand manner. Ji Cheng's arrogance suddenly came to him, and after living for more than twenty years, it was the first time he felt the blood stirring in his body. Brother count me one, the chubby man trembled and stood next to Ji Cheng, his whole body fat. A few people next to me also stood up. Walking and walking, there is no infinite world without blood. We cannot become the second generation of wealth and officials, but we must make our descendants become the second generation of gods. Ji Cheng rushed over with a few screaming guys in the high sky, completely invisible to everyone, for figures resembling gods and demons stood there, including the elderly, young people, strong men, and one dressed in black armor. And the one who spoke is the Iron Tower hero. Hartkas, don't be too harsh on them. It's already great that they can stand up and resist, after all, their world has been peaceful for a long time according to our lord, and their generation hasn't even seen blood. A handsome man wearing gorgeous armor and holding a knight's spear smiled to defend them. You can't let them run away like those cowards behind you, can you? Humph, chorus, others are brave but not strategic. The others behind them don't even want the basic common sense. Is it true that our lord used his divine power to teleport them to the projection dungeon to see how they escaped? What an idiot! Hartka snorted coldly and blacklisted those few in his heart. I don't know what my lord thinks. What's the use of bringing so many useless people from another world? Even if I exhale, I can make them die more than ten times, said a black knight next to him, dressed in full black armor and covering his face with paint. Cough, 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 cough. Carl, are you okay? It's said that the inheritance of the flowing night places a great burden on your body, and I didn't expect it to have such a great loss of lifespan. Chorus's handsome face was full of worries. You're the same age as us, look at you now, just like my grandfather. I can't say that. The flowing knight is one of the few legendary professions in the whole continent that can touch the existence of time at the legendary level. With such power, how could this profession not have any side effects? The black knight hummed. Forget it, don't even talk about it, cough 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 cough, cough 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 cough, business matters, business matters. 
Carl, the old knight, was trying to smooth things out again. Just as Ji Cheng and the others were desperately fighting, the four legendary knights, who were completing some mission for their main god Kasuth, also welcomed a group of players in an ordinary monastery thousands of miles away. I saw many players sitting cross-legged on the stone slabs in the hall of the monastery, listening to this fat guy with a face full of flesh, looking more like a butcher than a monk, proudly recounting the glorious history of the monastery. Our Alphonse Abbey was founded by my mentor Alphonse. Taylor was founded 137 years ago. At that time, my grandfather had already claimed to be the only warrior on the continent who could compete with gods. Now, his realm has reached an incredible level. I tell you, it is your luck to come here for several lifetimes. The fat guy said that the foam was flying, but the players below were absent thought minded. Indeed, they just claimed from the monastery that it was done by Alphonse. The chaos founded by Taylor himself. Coming out of the magic circle at the end of the game, it was truly a great physical and mental devastation. Even if they didn't collapse, it was their luck. Amitba Buddha, Buddha is above me. What exactly did I do to be assigned to this place by the infinite game? Little monk Hengla sat down, his gaze fixed, and he felt ten thousand regrets in his heart. Why was he so cheap and insisted on playing that game? This time, it's okay. In reality, I have to be a monk, and in the game, I still have to be a martial monk. Damn it, am I destined to be with a monk or something? Hey, don't be distracted by that monk from another world, listen carefully to me. The fat guy roared, and in an instant, the entire hall of the monastery was like a gust of wind at seven or eight levels, making the players feel embarrassed. I'll tell you, although I'm just a level seven monk, I can teach you how to start over in just a few minutes if I'm willing. Who wants to give it a try? The fat guy was very satisfied with the expressions on everyone's faces. He waved his martial monk robe and saw dozens of streams of light chasing out of his robe. In an instant, the streams of light rushed into the minds of the players. Immediately, the system issued a reminder in everyone's ears, attention players, you have obtained the martial arts knowledge condensed by Alphonse Taylor, the ancestor of martial monks. Attention players, you have obtained the second level martial arts skill, Bull Demon Powerful Fist. Bull Demon Powerful Fist. Why is the name so familiar? And it seems that this is not a martial monk's secret skill, right? Little monk Hengluv thought of the three types of Bull Demon Powerful Fist that appeared in his mind, Bull Demon Top Corner, Bull Demon Treading on the Feet, Bull Demon Lucky Skin, which became more familiar as he thought but he couldn't remember seeing them there. Don't underestimate this second-level martial arts skill, you guys. He is my ancestor Alphonse. Taylor, by chance, traveled to the outer world and gained it while communicating with the strong in a land god kingdom called the Great Zen Temple. I tell you that this is the strongest foundational martial arts skill in that land god kingdom. My ancestor spent a considerable amount of money to obtain it. You must study and practice hard, do you understand? Nyo Mo De Li Quan. De Chan Temple. Oh my god, I'll go, I'll fuck you. That chubby ancestor even stepped into the world of Yang Shen. He doesn't want to live anymore. He's not afraid of encountering any fierce man, will he just give him a turn? Little monk Henglu suddenly exclaimed, thinking of the origin of this martial arts skill. Obviously, he was not the only one who thought of it. Did the ancestor see the ruins of the great Zen temple, a man behind the little monk Henglu asked. What are you talking nonsense about? The fat guy was obviously scared by that person's words. According to the founder, there are at least a dozen legendary level warriors, four or five weak divine level warriors, and even one or two who cannot even see the depth of their existence. This is simply a divine system. What power can destroy such a existence? What a joke. Now it's like this, not necessarily in the future, players around exchanged glances and thought to themselves. The beginning of the world in Yang Shen began with the downfall of the Great Zen Temple. All right, you guys all stand up, train well, and work hard for the monastery. 
Let me tell you, just now each of you owed the monastery thirty divine coins. If you don't work hard, work hard to make money, you'll just wait to be sold to the black mine. Do you really think we Alphonse Abbey are volunteers, giving you martial arts skills for nothing? The fat guy looked at the eyes of many players, and it was like looking at divine coins, full of gold. No way, we're still forced to buy and sell here. Are we in a thief's den? The players suddenly let out screams of agony.